everybody welcome back super auto pets I, I have to tell you the test build has closed so i'm i'm going I, i'm on the antiquated super auto pets i'm i'm playing the weekly i don't even remember what half of these animals freaking do man i don't know <laughs> i feel like i've been in the crucible for too long we'll we'll see how it goes i guess okay i remember iguanas they are one threes that counter summon builds i am so far like out of my element man i it's fine. Well, all I'm going to say is we'll be a, a boasty stinker. How about a green stinker? Um, like Shrek, if he used your bathroom. I don't know. I feel like this is unwinnable. It's definitely uh, unwinnable, and that's okay. All I'm going to say is I personally... I wouldn't have, like, great expectations about how this run is going to go. Um, or the next run, or the run after, etc., etc. I think um, just having no expectations in general would be beneficial for me. Because it means that if I do actually pop off with a 10-piece, I can be like, You wouldn't believe the fact that I, I nobody gave us a chance, etc., etc. But, you know what? Nobody gave us a chance, and yet here we are. <laughs> Nobody has a hurt trigger either, huh? So you should move to the front. Plus three attack, minus one health. It's a little weird, but I'm going to give it a try. Um, it, I'm guessing, my guess at least, is it's going to take us a little while to like recalibrate um, to what Super Auto Pets is like when you're not just in the... The, the, I don't even know how to describe it. You know, when you're not in an artificially constrained environment where you only have access to the golden pack. So this is like, it's, it's certainly a, a whole new world. We're going to get ready to level up on our next turn. That's when the real game starts. We're also going to remember that this is like, um, it's the old health system, right? Which was at one point the new health system, but try not to get confused. I see what they got going on here. Pug into fish. We've, we've done it ourselves in the past. We're getting destroyed. Um, there's no two ways around it. This is like, we're losing to a degree that I is, I, I don't know if I ever thought it was even possible. Let's start with this. A lynx is good. Let's get rid of the, the hedgehog. He's not doing it for us. Let's add the lynx. Let's add a, an iguana, a lobster. Friends summoned if outside of battle, give it 2-2. Two, two. I'm going to ignore that for now. Let's keep the iguana. I Normally, I don't put a whole lot of hope on the iguana. This time, I'm going to. Hopefully, you just you understand what I'm saying. I'm not trying to build the idea that like we're going to be garbage forever. But I think it's going to take a little while. It's, it's like, um, you know, I don't know if, if you've ever gone skating, okay? But if you've ever gone skating, you skate a few times over the course of the winter. And then you put them away for nine months. First time you put them on after that, it's a little wonky. You know, you're, you're, you're not quite as... You need to get your sea legs back, you know? That's the best way to describe it, maybe. I think I'm going to unwind you to get a hatching chick out here. Knowing that at some point this fish is probably going to level up. Hopefully sooner rather than later. We could have added a dolphin, too. I mean, I don't, I don't have, like, an identity for this run right now. I'm kind of just sending it, which is dangerous. I remember how it used to feel when I knew what was happening with this pack. I used to have plans on occasion. Maybe not every time, but on occasion, there were plans. Hold on. Take the shot. Shoot the J. Shoot it. We'll draw these. Now I'm just kind of buying the animals we already have and hoping for the best. But one of these. Clearly, we're not losing. I know that this makes the iguana worse, but we're going to do it anyway. Are we are we keeping a toad? I mean, a, a, a toad is really good, but I think at some point we've kind of, we, we pot committed ourselves. A skunk is really good too. This is what I was hoping for. Friends with no held food get 1-1. One, one. We're probably selling a fish. Listen, I don't know. Here's the other, it's an opportunity is maybe a better way to think about it. Because there's a, I, I'd gotten stuck in my ways in Super Auto Pets. And there were animals where I was like, oh, I just under no circumstances will I ever take them. And then there were animals where I was like, I'll take them even if they don't fit on the squad. So this is an opportunity for us to maybe think outside of our, our own 
box a little bit. Don't take your level yet unless you... Well, let's do it. Crocodile can kind of go off too. Would we sell a Lynx to add a Crocodile knowing that it would get the buff? If there was a time to do it, the time would be now. And then I don't know how we should be handling this. Uh, <laughs> maybe like that. Okay, salad me. I don't think one Husky can, can get the squad rolling. Because the thing is... Pack three, like the, I, just for confusion's sake, the golden pack is noteworthy for having very poor scaling until like Birds of Paradise show up. That's, that's my assessment at least. So I, I'm in this ballpark now where I'm like, oh my god, a, a, a tier five level one unit that gives everyone a one one buff every turn? Like that's insane, but it might not be insane. That might be like well within the bounds of normalcy. Um, on, on an older pack. On this older pack, I should say. Like, I'm, no, 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 it's not gonna, you're not gonna get a buff anymore. That was still probably worth it, but at least don't give cheese to anybody else. Okay. Yes, yes, another husky. The iguana can still, can still hang, okay? I don't know. What are we on? We're on five wins or something? That's better than I would have expected. You're not summoning anything. I'm summoning something. I lived. Bro, there's, there's a lemon. That's why. I was trying to figure out why I was getting destroyed. It's, it, it, there's no garlic, I think, but the lemon goes hard. But I, I can't take a lemon myself or it'll invalidate my husky. Hold on. No chocolate either. Okay, okay. Well, we're on lethal, which again is also hard to get used to. We're on four wins. The husky's kind of, it's kind of popping. Certainly feel like the hatching chick doesn't need to be here. <laughs> That's for sure. <laughs> Okay, my whole squad has been uh, neutralized to a permanent end. Oh, my one! It's okay. You know what? Four is about where I would have expected us to be if I could choose. The rounds are going to be faster, man. They are. Simply because of the fact that the health system is the old health system. So, I'll be a frozen failure. Like, um... Prince Hans in the movie Frozen. I don't know if you've seen that uh, 30 to 40 times in the, in the last calendar year like I have. And <laughs> chill the frozen heart. And then, you know, Anna and Elsa are playing. And then, ooh, oh, we got to save her. Take her to the trolls. And then you're like spoilers. But I'm telling you, this is the first five minutes of the movie. Uh, well, thank God she didn't get her heart frozen. Otherwise, she would have been, for the first time in forever, do you want to build a snowman? Sorry, I got the order on those reverse, but you get the idea. Tell the guards to open up the gates, the gates. And then there, doom, love is an open door. Um, you know, Elsa freaks out, let it go. Um, we, the, people are, reindeers are better than people. You get the idea, okay? I'm not going to, the little fixer upper, the uh, reprise, first time in forever, and then the chanting at the end. Listen, I'm not, I'm not going to belabor the point, okay? I'm not going to insult you by giving you an exact rundown of everything that happens in the movie Frozen, okay? You've seen it 20 to 30 times this calendar year, I'm sure, just like me. There's no need for us to go, to go on with the rigmarole. Level me. All I want is a level. We should have many opportunities. I, ro I roll. I roll. Uh-oh. I... I don't know if this is right. <laughs> this is what I was looking for, though. Okay, actually, I think that this is not great. I think that we got a little bit screwed by variance on the first few rerolls. But that's the thing, people will be like, you shouldn't re-roll so much. Yeah, but how am I to know whether or not we're gonna, you know, get something on the next re-roll or not, you know? You, you all, you're always making an educated guess in life. That's what makes it, uh, that's what makes it so interesting. That's unfortunate, but that's, life goes on because we now are getting pogged up. Look at this. Look at this. Give me the dolphin. I know what you're thinking is like we, we could go Pug City and Pog City here, but an early dolphin kind of goes insanely hard. It kind of chills the frozen heart. I mean, thaws the frozen heart. I can't remember. 
listen, the first song in Frozen, don't don't hate the messenger on this one. For me, if I'm still getting my popcorn at the time that that song comes on, no big loss. It, it sets the mood, it sets the tone, but... I know some people are out there are going to be like, that's the best song. So, so be it. Tier 3. We are on shop tier 3. We should. We're, we're, we're a very stats-driven run right now. Why don't we just give you some meat? Her new arrangement. Wait, her new engagement is a flex arrangement. And by the way, I don't see no ring. You know what I'm talking about? Frozen? The whole thing's not going to be frozen. <laughs> okay, I'm just... Squeeze me 12. Good game, good game. I'm, I feel like I've captured a, a wave again, and I'm ready to go, man. Should take one of those. Deer is just a good animal. I would replace a fish with a deer. It's got upside potential for us. And our stats are looking mighty nice. Please tell me we screwed up their hedgehogs and their ox is going to die as a result. Please. No. Still got the win. I wanted them to do it to themselves, though. Steve Carell, in one of his most famous movies, do you like to do it yourself? Um, sometimes. <laughs> what a movie, man. Okay, I'm, I'm playing uh, Match the Animal again, and you know what? It's working! Oh, dude, we should have just taken a bison. Should have taken the easy way out on that one. Jake Lloyd from Star Wars Episode One: The Phantom Menace. It's working. Jake Lloyd from Star Wars Episode One: The Phantom Menace. I am going to become Darth Vader one day. When he said that quote, a lot of people, they have their own like headcanon and stuff. But for me, that's when he truly became Darth Vader. And was no longer the daughter, I mean the son of Shmi Skywalker. I think it's your turn to go. And your turn to stay. And the seahorse, I'm presently undecided. Yes. You know what? With no chocolate, these are pretty good foods. It would be very nice to get a bison starting to pop, though. I'm not feeling too pessimistic. I do feel like it's a week where maybe snipers can go off, though. Just based on, you know, what we've seen, really. In, on our, our sample size uh, of two. Seems like links can be pretty okay. Now I do see, hold on, we got a three, four, one, one, four. If we sold a seahorse and added a poodle, we would get nice buffs. We would lose the eight, nine, but it would, it would pay for itself pretty quick. I would buy this and, and then honestly, I'll just buy another one. I'd run it straight back. We run it down mid here. The deer getting the buff instead of the bison, kind of annoying. But I think, like, if I'm being real with you, level 2 deer, obviously important for us. Other uh, important things that could happen to us right now. This is nasty. This is strong kangaroo. Um, lemons. Like, lemons on as many tanky units as possible. It's a nice buff. Work with me. Ooh, they worked with me! <laughs> they worked with me hugely! Now, again, I'm not calling 10, but this does to me seem like kind of like an autopilot run right now. Which can be scary, because that means, like, in a way, I'm essentially saying, like, it doesn't matter what we do, our fate is already decided. But I would buy into that right now. I would take the over on, on whether or not we'd feel like we like that. You're going to give on 11-11. Like, the clownfish, it's been nice to have the buffs. But there's a, definitely a part of me that thinks, you know what? Maybe the time of, for that to have mattered that much has passed. We are going to want to give you a lemon someday. For now, I think we like this. I'm a simple man. I, I had uh, a, a simple rule. And my rule was, if you pass on a, pass on a stego, regret it forever. Now, whether or not that will actually come to pass here, I, I cannot say. What I can say is I, I think we're doing right by my previous understanding of the game, and I'm feeling okay. I'm feeling okay! 
one of these. A lemon on you, and I think this justifies that. I'm not gonna buy a cookie. We'll roll for better foods. This is a good food, because we're not buying too many animals at this point unless they match. I think that means we can be less um, picky about our food, which I know on the internet is a touchy subject, but in Super Auto Pets, I stand by it right now. Last round, I was out of my depth. This round, I'll just say it, man. Feels good to be back. <laughs> Turns out winning feels good uh, always, and losing feels bad most of the time, for sure. I would roll once here just to see if you get a, a paired animal, and we don't. So we, we take the autopilot shop yet again, and honestly, not feeling too bad about it. For round 13, the squad's looking pretty good. That's a scary look. Dude, they're gonna get, they're gonna get the win with the sloth! I think it's a very strong snake team. No, they're going to get the loss. I'm so sorry, because I, I genuinely thought you had it there with Big Sloth. But now it turns out that now I just look like I was sandbagging. So I'd like to apologize for that. Um, honestly, I would Melon you, and I would Melon you. Melon on the deer maybe is a little suspect. But I also think, like, we're, we're closing in on the 10-piece. Any single piece of equipment could make the difference. A 15 attack unit getting to attack twice? Sure, why not? Why not? Now they got a big worm. No question there. But I think we're punching through. I think we're breathing in the chemicals. I think this is, oh, the misery. Every single person is my enemy. Um, I thought that was our 10th win, just being honest, but whatever. <laughs> By this, we'll pop this down here. And we've gone off on, on quite a little heater here, if I do say so myself. This is also a very good looking team. The math on that was punishing. I think we draw. Ooh, but we're so close. <laughs> please, please, just, uh, just get me over the hump, man. I think you're okay with the carrot. I think we could afford the roll. I think we love it. I think we like it. I think this is still right. Even though, actually, you know what? It would be like best, I'd maybe, to give the stats to a unit that can actually have all the stats now. So I think we might as well max out our deer. 35 with a 39, 35 with a lemon. I think it's more effective to handle it like that, like we just did. Excuse me, why, why did it not give the stats? Excuse me. Excuse me, did they change the Stegosaurus recently? Did it not give as much in the stat to statistics department as I thought it would? Excuse me? What just happened? Not that it would have made a difference there, but... Give one random friend without held food? <laughs> Are you crazy? No! I can't believe, to be honest with you, it took me that long to notice it. Well, now I, he's a 1922... With melon armor, I can't, like, I can't break that up. What am I supposed to do about this, man? I just gotta, I'm leaving him on the squad and I'm praying. We should rework our order, though, that's for sure. Holy cow, I just assumed it was working. That's why you always read the fine print. Please. I'm thinking these lemons stand a chance to save us. They summoned another rooster, my word. I think we're still going to make it, in spite of my, my mistake. That's how you know our team was good. Okay, note to self. <laughs> Remember to, to fact check the Stegosaurus, but I'll, t I'll take my 10-piece. It's a good 10-piece indeed. I think this is a great starting squad. We got stats, we got shots, we got the promise of future stats. Maybe the Danish president. Couldn't name it. I'm going to guess his name is Per L... Perkinstein, is that correct? Let me just let me just take a look. I'm just trying to alt tab, but it's hard for me to alt tab because I hurt my thumb really badly. There we go, alt tab. Um, Danish president. Prime minister of Denmark is Meta Frederiksen. What did I say? Per, <laughs> per L. Perlson. Well, might have been offensive, quite frankly. I'd like to apologize. Um, 
But we got to learn how to laugh together. Because if we don't laugh together, we'll be laughed at together. So, just, just chew on that for a minute, okay? Let me know how that feels in the old brain computer. We are going to lose to the skunk badger. It's okay. It's just not the first time I've ever experienced a loss. A, a loss. <laughs> Um, no hurt triggers. Are there pills? No pills in this pack. Then I'm not taking a frigate bird. Are there hurt triggers in this pack, or is the frigate bird just like a, a lie? Seems like it might be a lie. I would take a, um, a panda. And honestly, just... There's no point in giving the panda the buff, because you're just losing half of it outright. Why don't you just take a, uh, some meat for now? There may be a day where it actually matters. But it won't be two days, that's for sure, because you were going to die in one hit. Hey, this team is a lot better than mine. That that glory we had after our last 10-piece uh, didn't last too long, did it? We're, we're falling apart. If possible, don't level yet. Okay. <laughs> level? Kangaroo. I think we should. I think we should sell the mosquito and we'll, we'll hope that the fish can still work out. And this should cascade to such a degree that the, the kangaroo could possibly... Well, will definitely get the triggers. It's just a matter of whether or not the seahorse is going to live long enough to give us some, some efficacy. And it did. It did. Okay, so now we're like a... We're panda and kangaroo pilled. I'll happily take a, a trophy and move on. How stats pilled are we? I think we're stats pilled enough to invest in that. That second panda could really, or the second level panda could really kick this around into gear, brother. It could really help out. Hold on. Oh, you horse. They're gonna get me. If that horse hadn't killed the seahorse, that's a, that's a draw. Or if that horse hadn't created the seahorse's death, that's a draw. But obviously, that's not how that went down. Give me my level. I actually feel like there's, been, there's some pretty okay foods in this pack. Maybe we can finesse it. Take a worm. Feed it a cupcake. It's immediately going to be 7-7. Seven, seven, so let's move this to like that. Roll me. Ooh. Well, listen. It wouldn't be the worst... You piece. It wouldn't be the worst outcome if we lost this round. Well, at least it wouldn't be the worst outcome in the short term. It might be the worst outcome in the long term. So I lost, but... Tell me why I'm not thrilled. I don't know. <laughs> Where did it, what happened? To... I was excited to lose, and then here we are, and I'm no longer happy. Okay, I like that. Obviously, like, you're gone. And we have to do buy sell, because there's not a third snail. This is going to put us on nine gold, so we got to do the buy sell. We buy. We sell. We buy. We may buy. Honestly, could just buy a cookie for the worm. And stick it up here, yeah. It's funny, like, the team doesn't look that bad. Don't, no, 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 the skunk. <laughs> it still doesn't look that bad. I think, well, you know why? That's because we're going to win this round. No wonder it doesn't look that bad. Okay, now let's, let's try to build something here. I don't think we really need a level 3 seahorse, but whatever. I'm going to set it up like this now. And don't forget to feed this guy some, some support. Should probably be investing a little bit more in the worm while you're here. Now, uh, the giraffe maybe doesn't have to be here anymore, but it is here. Two deer? Is this allowed? Oh, it's allowed. Please let me live through the first attack. <laughs> Sorry, I'll take my draw. We were we were one HP away, like one less attack on the chick away from making that. Okay, you obviously need to take this, even though we just gave you the meat. You need to take that. We look at the squad. 
I'm not buying. This is basically like purchasing an apple. I would rather just do that. Just because, like, buying an apple for the worm. What's funny is that if it was an apple, I'd probably be okay with it. I'd be like, dude, Pog, an apple, great held food. But because it's a lollipop, even though it has the same function as an apple, I'm like, no, I wouldn't be caught dead doing that. What do you think I am, stupid? Anyway, the lemon is just insanely great. This has enabled us to have more copium than we would otherwise. Four wins. Not, not a respectability quite yet, but... Keep the worm going. Should probably consider buffing your panda as well. Don't forget. But because now the panda's passing on. Well, it's passing on for sure, but it's also passing on 100% of his stats. So, my seahorse? I'm not sweating it yet. You know, and, and this is what we're able to do with a level one kangaroo. Just, uh, even just one more kangaroo has me feeling a little bit more bullish. We like it. We're not giving you a carrot. Someone could probably... Wait a minute. Okay, hold on. Sell you, and no matter who you buff, we're loving life. And then why not justify the Stegosaurus' existence a little further with one of these? So it can actually be a bit of a heavy hitter itself. If it hits the panda, that means it's hitting the worm. If it hits the kangaroo, then the kangaroo's doing well. Whatever. Whatever. It hit the... Oh, no. All right. Well, you know what? The dry step family took us out. I'll take my five wins. And we, we really ran the gamut today. A horrible run, a decent run, and a, and a 10 piece. For now, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, click the like button. Helps out a great deal. Of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future. And I'll see you next time. See ya!